tying run down at third. Brandon Phillips, two and two. And the pitch and the ground ball to the right side. The throw on to second for one out, and that's all they get as the run scores. Brandon Phillips from third. Bruce takes off, and again, the Reds are just going to run whenever they get a runner on base. Which, as you pointed out a moment ago, I'm not sure De La Rosa even looked at first for a second time in a inning. But there go the runners, and they both go in standing up. You really don't even need to sacrifice here is what I was going to finish the sentence because De La Rosa is not holding anybody on base. And there's a bouncer that'll bring in a pair. And Hamilton will go into second base with a two run double and a two run Cincinnati lead. Hamilton drives in a pair. It's a three run bottom of the second inning and Hamilton can walk down the third. It could be a very long night for the catcher Tony Walters if the Reds put runners on base every inning. That ball stung into left field. What an at bat by Kozak, who now has a hit in every game which he has played this season. Lotto of the rather Suarez running and without a throw, that's a fifth stolen base in the inning for the Reds.